Hey everyone, in this video we're going to check out this really cool 160 square foot shipping container home. We're going to meet up with Tony and Chris, the builders, and they're going to give us a full tour. They started this build with a used shipping container that was 20 feet by 8 feet. They added between 4 to 5 inches of foam insulation all around. The whole house is built to be plugged onto the grid for water, power, heating and cooling and he managed to build this amazing shipping container home in only six weeks. So now let's go meet up with Tony and Chris and have a look inside. What I really love about this unit is that it has distinct living spaces. You know, you have a nice kitchen area, you got plenty of room in there, but you also have a nice living room area that's completely separate. And what's cool about this area is it has a lot of light. You have two really large windows, they're both six foot by three foot windows, brings a lot of light into the space. Also on top of that, you have this nice sofa um, that can actually convert into a chase sofa, so almost like a chase lounge. As a chase, it can fit three people comfortably, so it provides a great space to hang out, watch a movie with some friends. Also, the sofa converts into a bed, and it turns into a queen-size bed, so it's plenty of room. Um, it has storage underneath the sofa cushions, so you can store your blankets, your pillows, your sheets, everything inside of there uh, to really make a nice, cozy bed. Another cool feature about the living room is the way we've utilized storage. So right underneath this TV, you can actually see uh, a little storage unit right here for your clothing. And so as you open it up, you got actually six cubbies for you to put your jeans, your shorts, your shirts, your jackets, really some good clothing space. Um, you also have some more uh, storage area in this room over here. And so you can store your books, uh, whatever kind of storage needs you may have. For the heating and cooling of the unit, we got a 9000 BTU AC slash heater unit. This thing works great and it's actually for something twice this size. It's for up to 400 square feet, so no problem cooling off the space or heating it up when necessary. For privacy, we have these awesome cordless cellular blinds. You just pull them right down, uh, blocks out any sunlight that might come in, and they work great. Not only does the bar cart have good room for storage, it also is great because it's on wheels, you can pull it over to the sofa area and it actually converts into a table. Welcome, we're in the kitchen. We have upper and lower cabinets. We did a navy blue color here. Gives it a little bit of uh, a pop to it. Uh, we have a microwave, uh, two burner induction stove, we got a fridge right here with a freezer in it. We have a beautiful sink with bronze accents basically all over the house. Uh, we did the all the hardware and the finishing touches in the oil bronze. We also have this really cool bar cart that we made out of pallet wood, multifunctional. Going from that, we also have uh, this cool chalkboard. Uh, we just kind of put on the side of the cabinet here. You can write your honey to-do list or your shopping list, whatever you have. Transitioning into the bathroom, we got this really cool pocket door. Uh, we did a little bit of the blue, go off of the kitchen, and uh, its pocket door slides right open. And you enter through the bathroom here. For a tiny home, we actually did a pretty good sized bathroom. We did a corrugated steel shower, decent sized shower. We also have a vanity that we built out of pallet wood as well. Uh, and we did a vessel sink on top and a pallet wood uh, mirror frame. And the cool thing about this bathroom that adds to the corrugated steel and the overall look of it is the pallet wood wall. We used three kinds of stain in it, mixed it up a little bit, and uh, I think it came out pretty well. Also, this cool ceiling, it's a, we, we, this is the first time we attempted it. It's a tin ceiling, gives it a really cool modern look, uh, almost a little vintage as well.
Hope you enjoyed checking out this container home. If you want to learn more about Tony and Chris and the amazing work they're doing, you can check out their website. The link is in the description of the video. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe. We post a new video every single week.